Hey y'all. Um, I just wanted to come and say thank you for my new subscribers, my new members. I appreciate y'all very much. Um, I am, I do see all of y'all's comments and I have just been trying to respond or whatever, but I've really been just really just trying to restore my peace. Um, that is my that is my main focus right now, and I, I want to make sure that um, I can still hold it down. Meaning, um, like I say, I asked big and, and worked hard to get the little piece of peace that I have, right? And that came along with changing my ways and the way I used to be and, and doing this, that, and the third. Um, so, <laughs> going back to this. Uh, I just want to just say, I don't care what nobody do on here or say in regards to me, okay? I do not care, okay? I have to maintain my peace. That's what I'm going to do. So, whatever, kudos to whoever feel like my content is born. I'm whack, I'm this, I'm that, all this and that, okay? Cool. That's cool. What's next? I just want to know what's next. Okay. Um, people who are sending me stuff to my inbox, uh, people who send stuff to my inbox in regards to record screen recordings and, 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 and comments, screenshots, I already told them y'all can stop doing that because I, I really don't care. Like, what you want me to do? Like, what you want me to do? I cannot control what people do and say. It ain't my job to do that. I don't, listen. <laughs> I don't care. I don't give a damn. What's next? Okay. I'm working on some stuff, some real life stuff. I'm working on myself. Um, I fell myself in the backslide and get real ghetto and, and act like I ain't got no sense on YouTube, on this, with, 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 with crazy folks, okay? I'm not finna do that. I got my own real life demons I'm dealing with and battling and trying to stay away from. Why in the hell would I come on here and entertain some virtual demons? I don't even have to. So I'd be the fool to, 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 to even do that, okay? So anyways, I am really, uh, stuck on and focus on my gym routine. I'm trying to lose my weight, y'all. Like I said, I'm trying to shed 10 pounds lost. I'd be good on that. Like, when I was 184 pounds, I was still thick. I was still in my thick zone. I'm not trying to be looking, you know what I'm saying, like pencil, or like a pencil out here. So, um, that is exciting. I am motivated. I'm going to the gym tonight, and y'all probably gonna see me jump on live at the gym. Uh, so, uh, I have finally got back into meditating and that shit works for me. Like, and I just, I've been getting into like just hearing, cause some of y'all know that sometimes I have a hard time going to sleep and I used to listen to like my, my frequencies, my African healing frequencies to help me go to sleep. And a lot of times they, they do help, but lately I've been getting into my, um, my, uh, it's like soft-spoken Bible scriptures that help you go to sleep. And that not only helps me, but it's, it just soothes my spirit just uh, overall. That's the kind of stuff I love to, it, to consume. That's the kind of stuff I like to hear. That's the kind of stuff I like to watch. And I share um, my girl, Miss Queen Poe. Please go follow her. YouTube, that is for people who are, who have a brain, who have a little bit of sense and care about their inner peace, who care about consuming their body or, you know, indulging in positivity or positive energy or whatever. Um, watching her is definitely a relief. It is, it's, it's a, it's like a breath of fresh air. Um, she talks to you about uh, spirituality, more about African spirituality. And I just love to learn about that. Like I've been saying in my previous videos, I like to learn about that stuff. 
I, I just don't want to be on a spiritual journey and not know where to start, what to do. You know what I'm saying? So she does help me. And I just get a, such a, I get a great vibe from her. An awesome vibe from her. I don't feel misled or redirected or whatever. Um, and at the end of the day, I can't depend on her, like, you know, to stream me along and tell me day by day what to do. I have to do my own work. And, um... And I'm grateful for that. I'm grateful to be a 33-year-old young lady who got a piece of brain and got a mind and is willing to um, be a bigger person in a lot of situations. Because I done had a lot of blessings stolen from me already. Because I chose to backslide or still trying to do stuff I ain't got no business doing and stuff like that. People got to grow up. I'm all about being grown. I don't have time for nothing else. I'm getting older, not younger. So why in the hell do I, do I look like, a, why would I want to act childish when I'm trying to get away from a childlike life or a childlike mindset or even thinking like a child, talking like a child, walking like a child? That's not it. That's not it. So, um, I am going to start back getting active on here, y'all. Um, I don't really have a lot of time for a story time right now because I am working. And, um, yeah, it's a lot of things that I want to talk about, but right now I just don't have a lot of time to do so. I want to thank my members again. I want to thank for all my super chats and I am going to do a private video for all my member members. And I do want y'all to respond and be engaged with those private uploads that I do do for y'all. And on another note, y'all like my headband wig? Now, I showed y'all in, in the video uh, me unboxing it. It is life. So, when I got it, it was not this fluffy. It was just, I had to fluff it out. And I did it with my hands. I endured a brush. And I probably got to go back and trim the ends a little bit just to get it, you know, cute or whatever it looks like it's wet and it's not all i did was fluff it out and i just kept the original headband that came with it and i just created my own baby hairs and of course i got a big ass forehead but it's still a look like it's giving it's definitely giving period so i'm definitely gonna be rocking this for a while because i can just pull my hair back in a ponytail slide this on do my baby hairs and that's it and I even can pin it up and all kind of stuff. So this is definitely my go-to look. Now, I do plan on dyeing my hair soon, y'all. So that means I'm going to have to get me another color wig. I always dye my hair burgundy. I mean, uh, blonde. So I might try to do burgundy this time just to do something different. Um, I just, you know, <laughs> like I said before, I don't want to be associated with nothing. I don't care to be associated with, with nothing no more or whatever. Or whatever. Like, whatever you get from, from me or whatever vibe you get from me, that's on you. I just know how to keep a G. I, I don't know. I don't be trying to please nobody. You know what I'm saying? I start now. Yeah, I was trying to do that. But see, no. When you learn stuff and you wait, you got to wake up. You got to be... When your mind is just always in a different space other than what everybody else be on... I'm not ashamed to say that because it be in a different space. But that's born to people or retarded or slow. That's okay because you, you you delayed. You the one need to catch up. You need to do It's a lot of people that need to catch up because this ain't it. It's not it. And it ain't ever going to be it. Not for no damn likes. I'm over that. I'm over there. It's a lot of people that still want me to do skits. If I gave a damn about some likes and views, don't you think I would be doing that? <clears throat> no. So, yeah. And I have tried something different, y'all. Yes, I'm drinking out of a beer mug because I just wanted to. I have fresh ginger root in my cup. I had a lemon in here, but the lemon kept coming out and all that. So I have fresh ginger root in my alkaline water because I am trying to 
help that helps with inflammation because by me going to the gym this this right ankle baby that thing be like that in the morning the ankle be swole so i'm trying to make sure that i be on top of that because i don't want um ankle pain and inflammation to keep me from being able to work out so i guess which you can call this a little, a little life update if you will but i'm just still you know what i said chilling um when stuff pop up on my feed, I, I, I'm I pretty sure I done blocked it, but sometimes it'll still pop up on my feed. And I hit the, them three dots. I'm not interested. Please don't recommend. Because ain't enough for, ain't, what am I, what am I going to get from it? Like sometimes, and I do still like to look and check in on certain people that I care to. But it's like, it ain't nothing else, ain't nothing else pop, ain't nothing else relevant. On another note, I'd be really on YouTube looking for something that can help me spiritually. I'd be looking for knowledge spiritually. Because that's what's important. I don't understand why people can't get in tune with that and why people don't. It, it, I'm, I'm passionate about that. And I've been talking about this since day one. I am very dedicated and I am obsessed with learning about spirituality. African spirituality at that. Because that's the most original to me. I do not believe in religion. That was something made up. I believe in just believing in God and believing and embracing the sun and energizing crystals to be blessed and manifesting and believing in yourself and, and creating positive energy around you. Because especially for me that I, I've been through so much. And I thank God I don't look like what I've been through. <laughs> Hello. I am grateful to be able to have just the urge to want to find, you know, the 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 depth to, to just be so engaged and want to know about this stuff and what can help me. A new meditate, uh, a new affirmation that I put out in the air. I got it from my queen Poe. So there is a new affirmation. It is for meditation purposes, and I have just started doing this recently because I got it from a girl, Queen Poe. So let's get into it. So you want to get whatever you need. If you want to, you know, burn your sage or burn your incense or whatever works for you. You don't have to. It's totally up to you. And if you do do that, open up these windows and let that negative energy flow out somewhere. And you sit and take your deep breath. And I like to close my eyes because it just, it just gives you peace. It's like when you close your eyes, you're just shutting off whatever is visible. You're just shutting off the world and you're just in your own zone. And then the affirmation goes like this. So you say this. I'll say, I say it throughout the day. But in the morning, and when you, you know, when you speak stuff into, and I'm learning this, when you speak it into an existence and you really mean it and you got power behind it, it's going to work for you. So it is, I am blessed, I am prosperous, I am abundant, and it is easy. I am blessed, I am prosperous, I am abundant and it is easy. So you keep saying that and you start to believe it feel good saying it to me. That feel good is is nurturing to my spirit. Man, I want my son to be able to look at me and say, or when he go through something in life, when he get and, and you know become an adult and say, "What well, my mama used to, my mama was a praying person." That's one thing I could say. My mom used to be like this and used to act crazy. Woo woo woo. But she didn't play about praying or she showed me or when he, I try to instill him now, but he's a teenager. He, you know, hopefully one day he get with the program, but at least he's around it and he will know. So when he's older, we don't have to be where we're not talking to each other or we're not dealing with each other or he don't want to be bothered with his mama. It's always going to be unity and love with that one. So I'm going to always keep that in my heart. Always. And I'm going to sit here and I'm going to be the bigger person only because I feel like, oh, my heart is necessary and because I'm a grown ass woman and I should be able to do that. And it is what it is because that's it's, it's a part of me releasing in negative energy. Whoever, y'all can have it. I have not released that to y'all. So do whatever the hell you want with it. I don't care. Make a mockery of it. Make a video of it. Blow it off. I don't care. I done released that, baby. So I, I ain't got to worry about none of it. 
I haven't been, but I feel like I can now move forward with what I'm trying to do because I have released that to the universe. I ain't got to be dealing with no negative stuff. Not from, not from, not from on no social media. No, 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 no. Honey, I got a lot of work to do and I'm excited about my journey. I'm not looking for nobody to guide me. I'm not looking for no influence. I'm looking for somebody that can show me who is, you know, <laughs> serious to who, you know, knows. And, and if I get a, uh, if I get that vibe from them, if you know, you know, I like to look for them for some type of, uh, uh, direction, not necessarily a guidance. Cause I get my guidance from him. Hmm. So with that being said, I hope that you all, uh, enjoy y'all evenings. I hope you enjoy your day. I don't know what time of the day or night that y'all are watching this. And please don't be ashamed to like, comment, and subscribe. All comments are welcome. And God bless you if you still walk, you know, walk around with, with evilness in your heart and hating your heart all the days of your life. Even if you just feel like it's cute for whatever reason you do it. A lot of things ain't cute. A lot of things I done did and posted on here ain't cute worth a damn. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. It is what it is. Feel how you feel. God bless you, child. And, um, you know, we got to pray for folks while we pray for ourselves sometime. And, um, yeah. And another thing is I'm not worried about, I, I, I'm glad that I was brought up around people who I brought up, strong women, spiritual women. And I do know how to, you know, block or knock out any negative energy. That is important, y'all. That is important to protect your peace and to protect your mind and your soul and to be serious and to, and to yearn for change, desire it. Crave for, I crave this stuff. I expect change for myself. So I'm working on it. And I'm glad I'm going to share it. I'm going to talk about it. Ain't nobody stopping me coming on here telling my stories. I want to talk about all the foolishness stuff that I used to do and deal with. Yeah. Release that into the universe. So I ain't got to deal with it no more. I done already done prayed about that. And I done been forgiven for all them. All them sins. Now I got to work on the sins that I keep repeating. That need to dig that I can't. God ain't going to keep forgiving. What about, what about y'all? What y'all working on trying to fix? I wait. Oh, okay. <laughs> y'all stay up and I will see y'all in another video. Peace.